the new House Ways and Means Committee chair. By the way, the youngest person ever to assume the job at the tender age of 42. I think I had ties older than this guy. Anyway, Jason Smith uh, joins us right now, the new House and Ways and Means Committee chair. Congratulations, Congressman. Thank you, sir. It's great to be with you. Maybe I could borrow some of those ties. That, yeah, you wouldn't that want might help anyway. me out. Yours look actually a little nicer. So let me ask you, sir, about these latest revelations. I don't want to throw it at you here. We don't know much more than I just said, but um, this could be a bubbling issue here. Uh, Documents that uh, you know we, we don't know, but we know that now another round could be found. Uh, this at a time when the administration had denied there were any in the very beginning. What do you make of it? You know, it's really concerning, and it, it, it means you better be careful. Uh, President Biden was so quick to go out there and throw President Trump under the bus about classified documents that, that were in Mar-a-Lago, and, and he said it was reckless and careless. Apparently, he's consistently doing it himself, and his team's doing it. So it's something that everyone's going to have to be treated the same way, regardless if you're the current president or the former president. Now, there's actually been a bipartisan but uh, the emphasis to get to the bottom of this. Mark Warner, the Democratic senator, wants to look into it. I don't know whether it will be the stuff of hearings and all, but it seems to be moving in that direction. Uh, do you think they're justified? Well, you know what? If they're breaching federal law, you need to look into it. And this is when he was vice president. This isn't when he was president. A president can declassify information. A vice president cannot. That's the difference between Biden and Trump in this situation. Um, Congressman, this issue over documents notwithstanding, you know, you are taking over probably one of the most powerful influential committees. Um, and if, I, I'm just wondering what your priorities are will be. It was this committee, your committee that you had now, that shepherded those Trump tax cuts through. Uh, and there's talk that you and your colleagues want to try that again, but in a very different environment where the Republican edge is small and you're dealing with a Democratic Senate and a Democratic president. What are your plans? You know, we're the party of the working class. I've said that from day one. Republicans are the party of the working class. Democrats say that they're the party of the working class. Let's work on tax policy and trade policy that helps deliver for the working class. Wage increase uh, paychecks, create more jobs. We need to have hearings throughout this country, filled hearings, not just in Washington, D.C., but where real Americans are, so we can look at the provisions of the Tax Cut and Jobs Act that was passed in 2017 to see what provisions worked, what provisions did not work, and which ones might be changed. And we also need to look at the tax code to make sure that we, we strengthen our strategic supply chain when it comes to energy, food and health care. You know, um, I'm ping ponging, but if you'll indulge me, Chairman, um, there's a great deal of talk back and forth back in Nassau County, uh, where uh, the, the newly elected and sworn in George Santos is from, um, to, to, to take him down, to get him out of Congress. Uh, Kevin McCarthy, we're told the new speaker, uh, is not giving him any committee assignments, and many in your party have been saying he's a pariah and that his lies show that he's of no use and of little value to Republicans. Um, do you think he should go? I think the voters of New York are the ones to decide that. It's not, it's not for myself or other members of Congress to consider that. It's the people of New York who elected him, and that's who he's held accountable to. Do you agree with what Kevin McCarthy did in the meantime not to give him any committee assignments? I will never doubt what Speaker McCarthy wants to do in his role. That's why he's Speaker of the House, and that's why I'm Chairman of the House Ways and Means Committee. That's a very, very, that shows a great discretion in that answer. Let me ask you finally about this push to make good on a lot of the plans uh, that were ultimately passed and approved in the Rules Committee and out of all rules for the House. And that includes tying spending within a debt limit agreement or to, to when the debt is, is up again, uh, which almost guarantees in some people's eyes a government shutdown. If, if when we are looking at increasing that debt limit, we are adjusting spending in the interim. Democrats want no part of it. Some of your more moderate colleagues are worried where it could go. How do you feel about it? Nil, inflation's gone up 14.3% since Joe Biden's taken the oath of office because of their reckless spending. The American people spoke in November by electing a House 
House Republican majority to get spending in order and to stop reckless spending. So we need to use every tool in the toolbox uh, to make sure that we combat this re reckless spending. And that would include a tool like a government shutdown. In other words, that you are open to that. That's a, a, a no, arrow in your no, not at it's not, not something at all, you want at would, first, but you don't. I would take never it out. think that I would never think that President Biden would ever, ever default on the debt limit if we give him a bill that increases the debt limit but also reduces reckless spending. I never. I don't believe Joe Biden would want to default if we delivered that. So you would put it on him if. If you default. If he doesn't sign it, he'd be the one defaulting. We can pass a debt limit that does do fiscal re reforms that helps deliver on the promises what the American people want. And that's what they want is less government spending. Got it. All right, Chairman, thank you again. Congratulations. Yeah.